Welcome once again to the Chaos Chamber. Um, in this video, I'm going to redo an old video that uh, glitched when I uploaded it to YouTube. I'm going to redo Icy Spirits. Um, and the so the method I'm going to use is, you can find it in my book, The Sigil Secret. Um, that's available from Treadwells in London, and you can get it on Amazon as well. I'll put a link in the video, uh, in the comments of the video below. Um, so let's start with the statement. So I see spirits um, so with all of these patterns as I describe in the book we're going to take out the first thing we do is remove all the vowels so we end up with uh, two S's a P R T and another S um, I then go through and remove all the duplicate letters so we end up, it's quite a, a simple one, this one. S-P-R-T, okay. So I'm now going to take those, all of these letters, and make them into a sigil. So I'm going to sort of start from left to right. I'm going to start with the S. Come down here with the P. Take an R off of here. And then a T, like that. And then I put these little lines and circles on, um... They come from planetary magic to sort of denote the beginning and the end of the sigil. So there's a first variant of it. Um, I'll do it again, and this time I'm going to go backwards from T to S. Now, I often like to use the T as kind of a, uh, I suppose, a, a post, I guess, <laughs> like a starting point. And then I can take the R off of there. It tends to produce a, a sort of a different style of sigil um, and I'm just putting things as I feel like it at the moment um, and then I'll put the S there backwards there we go so uh, sometimes with the the simpler sigils you can get something actually that looks more I don't know I prefer it sometimes it's a bit less messy than the um than the, than the longer ones um and let's do one more so I'm going to use the P as the Kind of starting point here, I'll do it down here. It's a little bit easier for me to get my hand in. And then I'm gonna take the R off of the back of it like that, put the T there, and then an S. Let's just put the S here. Now when I do this, I just try and freehand it as much as possible. I don't really think about what I'm doing. Um, and so there's three versions of Icy Spirits. Again, you can always, if you feel like it, roughly encircle them or put them in a triangle something like that and there you have it so hopefully uh, youtube won't eat this one um don't forget to like and subscribe visit me at the uh, www.thechaoschamber.com and i'll see you on the next video